While he was tidying up a room in his grandparents' house, this boy stumbled upon a mysterious safe box. When he opened it, he discovered a decades-old secret that left everyone in awe. It was that time of the year again, and Todd was en route to his grandparents' place. This year marked a change. For the first time, Todd was set to celebrate the holiday season in his grandmother's inviting home. The house was in a secluded area, very far from the city where Todd and his parents lived, and for this very reason he had never been there. But this year was different. Excitement buzzed within him as he looked forward to immersing himself in the holiday traditions of the house where his father had grown up. As his parents' car pulled into the garage, Todd's anticipation soared. The air was filled with the comforting aroma of holiday spices, and his grandmother's warm smile welcomed him as he stepped out of the car, inviting him into a world he had previously only heard about in her stories. As his parents left to do some last-minute shopping, Todd settled into the cozy living room, surrounded by the flickering lights of the Christmas tree. The walls of the house were adorned with portraits of his late grandfather, a man Todd had only known through stories and faded photographs. Little did the boy know that within the familiar walls of his grandparents' house, an unexpected peace awaited him, a discovery that would leave him shocked and intrigued. As he continued to admire his grandpa's portraits hanging on the walls, his grandmother entered the room with a gentle smile. Politely, she asked Todd for a favor, to help clean and arrange the pottery room so they could have a little fun together in the afternoon. Eager to explore every corner of his grandparents' home, he nodded in agreement. Todd followed his grandmother's directions and headed to the basement pottery room. When he walked in, he found a jumble of relics, trophies, cardboard boxes, and ancient pottery scattered around. Without hesitation, Todd got to work organizing the space. Intrigued, he examined each item closely, appreciating the craftsmanship and attempting to unravel the purpose behind these unique artifacts he had never encountered before. What started as a simple act of helping his grandmother soon transformed into an unexpected treasure hunt. As Todd attempted to place items on a shelf above him, one piece slipped from his grasp, clattering to the ground. However, it wasn't the fallen pottery that caught his attention. It was the peculiar sound it made upon impact. The floor sounded hollow, almost as if another room was hidden under the boy's feet. Todd's instincts kicked in, and he pounded his fist on the ground, realizing that the sound indicated something more than a mere basement floor. The sense of a hidden secret began to dawn on him. Intrigued by his discovery, Todd moved to the edge of the room, determined to unveil the mystery beneath the carpet-covered ground. With anticipation building, he carefully lifted the carpet, revealing an inconspicuous trapdoor. Todd's eyes sparkled with excitement. His instincts had led him to a false ground, a concealed entry into the unknown. Questions raced through his mind. What secrets lay beneath? And why were they hidden in the first place? As Todd hesitated, contemplating the decision to open the concealed entrance, the weight of potential revelations hung in the air. With a deep breath, Todd made up his mind. With determination in his eyes, he quietly lifted off the opening, revealing a small enclosure beneath. The dim light exposed a tiny room filled with dusty boxes, vintage trinkets, and an unmistakable sense of forgotten history. As he descended into the hidden chamber, it became apparent that the items within had been undisturbed for years, judging by the cobwebs in the corners. Fascinated by the untouched mystery of the hidden room, Todd couldn't help but ponder which important artifacts his grandfather had chosen to keep hidden. His curiosity drove him to examine each item individually, from ancient pottery to dusty bottles. In the midst of the collection, a shiny yet weathered object caught his eye. His attention focused on a box, not just any box, but one that appeared to be the missing piece of the elusive puzzle. At that moment, Todd felt like the main character in a Mission Impossible film, uncovering secrets concealed within his grandfather's house. Without hesitation, Todd carefully retrieved the box, blowing off the layers of dust that had settled on its surface. Placing it on a nearby table, he observed the rectangular and metallic structure. The box was no ordinary container. 
It was a metal safe, its once shiny surface now dulled by the passage of time. As he examined the safe, Todd realized that he lacked the combination to unlock its mysteries. Eager as he was to discover the secrets hidden within, he pondered his next move. The idea of seeking his grandmother's guidance crossed his mind. After all, she was not only his grandmother, but also his grandfather's wife. Perhaps she knew the combination to open the box and to unveil the contents of the metal safe. Carrying the metal safe box in hand, Todd left the hidden chamber and headed towards the living area where he expected to find his grandmother. As soon as he spotted her, a look of surprise crossed her face, and before Todd could utter a word, she questioned if he had truly tidied up the room so quickly. Eager to share his discovery, the boy explained that the room was not only tidied, but also harbored a secret beneath its floor. His grandmother's eyes widened in astonishment, and Todd was taken aback by the fact that she seemed unaware of the hidden chamber beneath her own home. Drawing her attention to the metal safe box, Todd recounted the adventure in the basement and the mysteries it held. To his disappointment, his grandmother seemed equally clueless about the existence of the hidden chamber, despite being the owner of the house. The revelation puzzled him, as he had assumed she would possess some knowledge of the concealed space and its contents. As Todd showed her the metal safe, hoping for a breakthrough, his grandmother's surprise deepened. However, she confessed that she didn't know the combination code to unlock the safe either. For a brief moment, paranoia gripped Todd's thoughts. He wondered if his grandmother was feigning ignorance to protect a long-guarded family secret. The uncertainty lingered in the air, casting a shadow over Todd's initial excitement. Determined to unravel the mystery, Todd asked his grandmother once more about the combination, urging her to dig deep into her memories. He suggested that perhaps the passage of years had erased the knowledge, and she needed to retrace her steps to recall any details about the box and its secrets. Todd hoped that encouraging her to think back might jog her memory and unveil the elusive combination. Her grandmother found herself perplexed by the situation. She admitted that the discovery of a hidden chamber in her own house was as surprising to her as it was to Todd. Her confusion mirrored her grandson's, leaving him with the realization that her lack of knowledge was genuine. With this revelation, Todd grappled with the understanding that the hidden secrets of the metal safe remained locked away, even from the person who owned the house. Accepting that his grandmother genuinely had no knowledge of the hidden chamber or the safe's combination, Todd contemplated alternative ways to satisfy his curiosity. Determined to uncover the secrets within, he considered bypassing the combination and simply destroying the safe, risking the unknown consequences to satisfy his thirst for the truth. So, instead of going back to the room and tidying it up like his grandmother still wanted him to do, Todd searched the house and found some basic power tools, a hammer, pliers, and a chisel. Armed with these, he set out to open the small safe. The old and rusty tin box didn't put up much of a fight against Todd's determined efforts and the power tools. After a short while, the safe gave in, unveiling its contents to the intrigued explorer. The box contents were a puzzle in themselves. Todd's eyes fell upon a note as he opened the safe, and he quickly retrieved it to read its cryptic message. Abandon all regret, ye who enter here. Initially puzzled by the archaic language, Todd wondered if such phrases were common in the past. Seeking clarification, he reached for his cell phone and conducted a quick internet search. The results revealed that the words were a play on Dante's famous line, Abandon all hope, all ye who enter here. Satisfied with this knowledge, Todd set the note aside, eager to explore the other mysteries hidden within the box. The next item in the box presented another code or secret message, prompting Todd to engage his deciphering skills once again. This time, he uncovered a black cloth with several objects wrapped inside. Unraveling the cloth, Todd discovered a myriad of stamps, some from countries that no longer existed, including the Soviet Union, Zir, and the Arab Democratic Republic. However, what captured his attention the most were the Chinese characters inscribed on the black cloth. Curiosity led Todd to grab his phone once again, this time to decode the meaning of the Chinese symbols. 
the internet revealed that the characters meant double happiness, a symbol often associated with weddings and other joyous Chinese ceremonies. The revelation hinted at Todd's grandfather being a positive individual, and it sparked his imagination about the celebratory events his grandfather might have experienced. Pressing on with a sense of curiosity, Todd unearthed an old leather pouch, its faint red seal bearing the date 1776. Excitement surged as he opened the pouch, revealing a treasure trove that would make collectors and history enthusiasts alike marvel at its contents. Carefully, he removed a handful of items, each holding the weight of history within its worn edges. The first discovery within the pouch was a pocket watch, perfectly protected by a British Army-issued barrel cloth that looked remarkably preserved, as if it had just left the factory. Among the historical items was also a silver lamp, which initially left Todd wondering if it harbored its own secrets. However, upon closer inspection, it turned out to be just a lamp, causing a tinge of disappointment in the boy's eyes. His imagination had momentarily run wild, envisioning the possibility of a genie lamp with untold wishes. But the excitement came back as soon as he stumbled upon some unexpectedly personal treasures, old photographs of his ancestors and great-grandfather. One photo stood out, capturing his great-grandmother posing in a window frame, frozen in time for over a century. Another image featured his great-grandfather, radiating a timeless sense of class with a pipe in hand and round-framed spectacles. These pictures told stories of a bygone era, reflecting the grace and style of Todd's forebears. Despite the already astonishing discoveries, the safe still held more surprises. Further exploration led Todd to a plastic container. Inside, he uncovered a collection of coins and various assorted items, each holding significance in its own right. A search on the internet revealed the value of some particularly rare coins, with the 1921 Morgan Silver Dollar standing out in its impressive condition. However, what truly stood out in the plastic container were two pieces of World War I memorabilia. Among them was a medal given to Commonwealth troops who had served in the theater of war. Todd observed the intricate details, recognizing the historical weight that these items carried. As Todd delved deeper, he discovered a super rare Pakistani coin among the collection, adding another layer of intrigue to the historical treasures within the plastic container. The coin spoke of empires and countries long gone, preserving a narrative that transcended generations. Excited by his priceless discoveries, he called his grandmother to the scene, her eyes swelling with surprise at the ancient relics the box held. The old woman admired the neat pocket watch in the photograph of Todd's great-grandfather and felt inspired to tell her grandson about her parents and the amazing lives they had lived. While she spoke, Todd took out his cell phone and captured images of all the items in the box. Carefully placing each artifact back in the box, he carried it back to the room where he had made the intriguing discovery. This time, however, he didn't return the box to the underground chamber. Instead, he placed the metal safe box in a drawer with an easy reach, ensuring that it remained accessible at all times. Todd's grandmother kept delighting him with funny or heartwarming anecdotes about his great-grandparents. As she walked him along memory lane, he diligently resumed his original task of rearranging the room, his mind still consumed by the quest for answers. This small room had kept these shocking secrets hidden for decades, but what about the rest of the house? What if his ancestors had hidden treasures for him to find all around their home? Without hesitation, he embarked on a thorough search of the entire home, hoping to stumble upon the lock that the mysterious key was designed to open. His imagination danced with visions of treasure chests and hidden chambers filled with historical wonders. But after scouring every nook and cranny of the house, Todd's quest for additional treasures proved fruitless. He only discovered spiderwebs and dust, and at the end of the day, he was forced to admit that the secret room in the basement was the only real treasure. That night, Todd found himself lying on his bed and strolling through posts on his Imgur account. A sudden realization struck him. What if the Imgur community could provide insights into the rare items he had discovered? Excitement lighting up his face, he decided to share his findings on the platform, 
posting pictures and details of the artifacts he had carefully cataloged earlier. As Todd drifted off to sleep, he eagerly anticipated the responses that might come overnight. The next morning, he was awakened by a symphony of notifications on his phone. Opening his Imgur app, he was greeted by a flood of engagements from rare item and artifact collectors worldwide. The Imgur community had weighed in, pointing out the worth and values of the coins, the pocket watch, and other items. The unexpected appraisal left Todd in awe, realizing the true significance of the treasures he had unearthed. If his family ever decided to auction those items, they would become rich beyond imagination. That day, Todd realized that this holiday season had been more special than he could have imagined. Not only did he spend time with his grandmother, but he also glimpsed into the past through artifacts and photos of his ancestors. The images of his great-grandfather and great-grandmother provided a connection to a bygone era, and Todd marveled at the thought that his late grandfather had left behind not just items, but memories that transcended time. The holidays had become more than just a time for festive cheer. They had become a time for connection, reflection, and the celebration of the rich tapestry of family history. And so, with a heart full of appreciation, Todd embraced the rest of the holiday season, cherishing the memories and the newfound sense of connection that would linger long after the decorations were packed away. What an interesting discovery! Have you unexpectedly come across an ancient family relic? Tell us what it was in the comments section. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.